Hey everybody, Eric here, back with another video. So Texas has an interesting story when it comes to ending the PUA and the PEUC early. Governor Abbott has been hit with so many lawsuits, some to do with unemployment, others to do with the pandemic mandates. It's just a big mess at this point. The state tried to schedule not one, not two, but three hearings on the issue of ending these federal unemployment benefits early. Here's where it gets weird. They ended up having a hearing on the issue of ending these federal unemployment benefits early, but they released nothing following that hearing. Pretty fishy. The speculation is that when the news of what actually went down in this hearing comes out, that it will be released at a local news level. It is not expected to be picked up nationally. This is unfortunate because this is a major issue. This put a lot of Texans in a really bad spot, and in my opinion, it was unnecessary. You didn't have to end them early. You could have waited until September, but instead they pulled the plug, and in my opinion, it was a bad choice. As bad as this looked when it happened, it's starting to look worse. Research coming from the Economic Policy Institute Based on analysis of data from early state level unemployment terminations has shown that any potential gain to job growth driven by lower benefits is offset by what economists refer to as the customer demand effect. This effect describes the situation in which households tend to spend less when unemployment benefits are reduced, ultimately leading to a drag in job growth. On top of that, new research has found that early termination of extended benefits only led to a small increase in job finding. Hindsight is 2020, but damn, I feel like a lot of us saw that this was a bad idea right when it was happening. If you're in a tough position, I am sorry, I feel for you. I am going to do my part for my viewers to get through to the TWC as fast as possible. I am giving my viewers free access to a call service, Claimer. Now, Claimer guarantees to get a representative from the TWC on the phone so you can get more clarity on your claim. They suggest that you carve out one to two hours of time just because obviously these phone calls can take a while. If you're interested and want a free call to the TWC using the service, the sign-up sheet is in the description. It's just your name and your number. Now, you don't have to specify a time on the sheet. I will actually text you and say, hey, what time works for you? You text me back, let me know what time. I then punch your number in and you are good to go. The only thing I ask is that you keep me posted on if you got through or not. If you enjoyed this video, please do me a favor, like the video and subscribe to the channel. Also, hit me up in the comments for topics that you would like me to cover in the future. I wish everybody well. I wish I had better news. I will see you on the next one.